I'm so excited to be introducing my limited edition collaboration with the legendary photographer Norman Parkinson and his archive. Today I'm going to show you how to get the Miss Kensington look. The Miss Kensington look is very much inspired by the quintessentially English haughty but naughty girls of the swinging 60s. I've drawn my inspiration from the pastel hues and the cascading light in Norman Parkinson's pictures of his beautiful muses such as Twiggy, Audrey Hepburn, Ava Gardner and Wenda, his wife. It's all about rose petal lips, dreamy skin, mesmerizing eyes, and legendary 60s lashes. I never ever start a makeup without my miracle working magic cream. It floods the skin with hyaluronic acid, rose hip and almond oils, and instantly transforms tired, dull skin into the perfect canvas for makeup. Apply it to your face, massaging upwards and outwards in angel wing motion, across the cheeks, forehead and the neck for instantly hydrated and nourished skin. Prep perfect lips using my revolutionary lip elixir, Lip Magic. It's packed with a magical ingredient called propolis that's known for its amazing healing powers. It even provides an antibacterial barrier against germs and leaves your lips looking gorgeously soft and kissable. To create radiant, youth-boosted skin that looks like it's lit from within, I'm going to apply a small amount of my Wonder Glow all over the face. The amazing thing about Wonder Glow is that it's a revolutionary skincare product that contains a genius ingredient called Fluorescent Core that makes you look like you're lit from within. It instantly gives you that fabulous, gorgeous, healthy Brazilian holiday skin that everyone wants. I call it Giselle Najar. To create the perfect Miss Kensington red carpet skin, I'm going to use my incredible Youth Boosting Light Wonder Foundation in number seven. It contains an organic alternative to retinol that leaves your skin looking perfected and flawless. I'm using my revolutionary new foundation brush to apply the Light Wonder Foundation. It is the most incredible brush as it makes any foundation super quick and easy to apply. Use my amazing retoucher pen in number two to conceal any under eye bags or darkness. Notice that I'm tapping it into the skin, not rubbing, as the eye area is extremely delicate and when you tap, you're pushing it into the skin as opposed to wiping it off. This makes for better coverage and it means it lasts longer. I'm now going to use the retoucher pen in number three to conceal any naughty blemishes. The amazing thing about the concealer is that it contains a lipidic complex and that acts like a healing plaster, protecting and smoothing over any blemishes on the skin. Apply as much or as little as you need. Use my sculpt and powder brush to apply micro finely milled powder onto your T-zone for a perfected cashmere complexion. I'm creating gorgeous full brows for my Miss Kensington look. Using my brow lift in Grace K, brush up the brows and then fill in the brow using my specially designed pen that mimics the natural shape of your brows for perfect and easy application. For sensational 60s lashes, use my rose gold life-changing lash curlers. Clamp the lashes tightly at the root for five to 10 seconds. Now, I'm going to show you how to create mesmerizing eyes with my new cream shadows. The colors are really flattering on all eye colors. I'm going to start by softly blending the gorgeous gilded oyster color, Marie Antoinette, all over the lid with my blender brush, right up into the socket, and then working it backwards and forwards like a windscreen wiper across the lid. Now, using my smudger brush to run the Marie Antoinette shade under the eye, backwards and forwards for a soft, sultry definition. For instantly bigger, brighter, wider eyes, apply the jean shade into the inner corners of the eye using my smudger brush. Blend it out into a V shape along the lower and upper lash line. Next, I'm going to define the eyes using the incredible Rock and Coal Liner in Barbarella Brown. Trace your pencil along the upper lash line and then extend the liner to kick out at the end. My Rock and Coal pen is waterproof and lasts for up to 14 hours. It literally doesn't move and will last all night. Now apply lashings of mascara to finish your eye look. You can never have enough mascara. 
When applying your mascara, make sure you get right into the root of the lashes. Use the specially designed tapered endpoint of the mascara wand to individually coat the tiny lower lashes. Carving Miss Kensington killer cheekbones with my amazing Filmstar Bronze and Glow palette. Simply suck in your cheekbones and follow the hollow. Drip my heavenly dreamy highlighter onto the top of the cheekbone, onto the top of the cupid's bow and down the bridge of the nose. This will give you gorgeous dreamy skin. Start by reshaping and resizing the lips with my Lip Cheek Lip Liner in Pillow Talk. It's a pretty soft lip pencil that mimics the natural rose buddy hue of the lips. Trace the outer line of your lips to provide a natural template for your lipstick. Apply the Pretty Pink Matte Revolution Lipstick in Miss Kensington straight from the bullet. I designed it especially to mimic the shape of a lip brush so that you can easily apply it when you're on the go. Lighter colours are very forgiving and so you can always apply them straight from the bullet. This blusher transports me to a world of castaway dreamlike paradise. I named this youthful blush the Colour of Youth because it's inspired by Norman and Wenda's endless blush of love for each other. Apply my Colour of Youth blush to the apples of the cheeks with your fingers. It's a pretty pink, it's the delicate rosy hue that you see on young, innocent and fresh cheeks, like on my nine month old baby. It contains an amazing ingredient called the Berry Flux Vita that increases hyaluronic acid to flood the skin with moisture. So there you have it, the dreamy Miss Kensington look inspired by the legendary photographer Norman Parkinson.